Time for this week's Moors Millions then. Leg four, this one, it's a three mile five version this time, 0 to 140. At the top, we've got Finding Alice for Martin Leadham. Lincoln Holt, Darren Thompson, Ella Casigida for Padre Hogan. It's also got L Woods, Tuxford, Darren Thompson, Rose Tree, David Early, Velvet Sky, Craig Beckwith, Langley Streak, Graham Clutterbuck, Settler, Craig Beckwith, Ideal Art, David Hooley, Place the Duchess and Classic Chance for Alex Cherry, Penelope Pitstop for Martin Leader, and Matt Cooper's got the bottom pair, Stone Cold, Steve Austin and Amanda. Called in and away. And the first of today's two Moors Millions, the next one's a four mile pluser. This one's a three mile five. Two finals at Liverpool. Back end of the season, last week of the season, I think. One's over 3 5 and one's over 4 3, I think, as they jump the first. And bizarrely, it doesn't matter which qualifier you qualify for, sir. You qualify for the 3.5, 3 mile 5 furlong. If you qualify in the 3 mile 3 5 furlong race, you can still go in the 4 mile 3 final, which I don't understand that. I don't know. What's the point then? As we get over the second, you might as well just as well have just one list of qualifying horses regardless you should have to have to run in the one you qualified in but anyway not up to me place the duchess is the leader as they get down to the third l woods in second gonna be pit stop stone cold steve austin's after that one velvet sky and classic chance then finding nice the great and towards the back ideal art is the early back marker as they come down to the fourth and the leader really got into that fence nicely jumped away from it quickly and he's five clear now plays the duchess for alex cherry and a quiet start to the season got his first winner last week oh and he went right through that one and nearly on the ship the pilot was going to say it looks maybe that was a turning point for him and he's going to start looking up but he'll need place the duchess to jump a little bit better than that if that's going to be the case, as they get into this ditch, and she jumped that one nicely. All safely over it. With Amanda now, the back marker, but it's placed the Duchess who's got the lead. Penelope Pitstop is second. Then L Woods and Stone Gold Steve Austin with Lincoln Holt on the inside of Alex Cherry to the Hunter. Classic chance. Then Ella Casida is after that one, and Rose Tree as they come into number seven. And there's something gone there. It's Classic Chance. It's Alex Cherry's other one. So Really put a kibosh on Alex by mentioning him. Sorry about that, mate. And it's placed the Duchess in the lead. On Stone Cold Steve Austin second. Let me pit stop on the rail is third. Between the two of them, L Woods and Lincoln Holt. And the second Darren Thompson was right behind that one is Tuxford. And we've got Velvet Sky and Alakasaida. As they get into number eight. Which they all get over nicely. Place and Duchess continuing to lead. Leading by about four to Penelope Pit Stop in second. And then Stone Cold Steve Austin third. And place the Duchess. Holding along nicely in the lead by four lengths or so. So Stone Cold Steve Austin and Penelope Pit Stop, then Tuxford and Lincoln Holt. L Woods is next. Then Velvet Sky on the inside as they take number 10. Penelope Pit Stop was a bit slow at that one. Looking towards the back. Penelope Pit Stop stable weight finding Alice is the back marker. And place the Duchess is continuing to show their way. They all get over the 11th without mishap. Half a jumping done there. We come up past the big stand and the big screen past the winning post and another circuit of Fairy House to go. And place the Duchess. He's three lengths clear of Tuxford and now moved through into second. Lincoln Holt Stable companion is going with him to make it a 2 3 for Darren Thompson. Penelope pitched up on the inside rail is still there with a share of third or fourth as they get over the next. With Stone Cold Steve Austin, Ella Casaida is getting closer up the inside. The one around the outside that's making ground is Langley Streak. They're pretty closely packed, really, for a long distance race. This 
Find your list. The back marker's probably 12 lengths off the leader. Then it's placed the Duchess, who is that leader, into this ditch. As they all stream over that one, they all got every no gate. With place the Duchess in front. Lincoln Holt second. Melopy Bits top third. Tux Vanilla Casayeda in the Woods and Langley Streak. In Stone Cold Steve Austin. Velvet Skies after that. Set the stable mate to that one. He's tracking it. Then Ideal Art and Rose Tree together as they get over the 14th. The back two are finding Alice and Amanda. But up top now, place the Duchess has been joined by Lincoln Holt. Penelope Pitstop tucked in behind in third. Then come the Patrick Hogan, Pere El Casagida and El Woods, Langley Street wide on the track as they get over the 15th, which they all get over okay, although finding that this was very untidy at the back. It's placed the Duchess who continues to lead. Penelope Pitstop second, Lincoln Holt third. Over this next one they go and Penelope Pitstop jumped alongside the leader there and has poked her head in front. So Penelope Pitstop plays the Duchess, Lincoln Holt, L. Woods, Langley Street, L. Casaida. Plenty of chances in this one still. Tuxford starting to get back into it again. Velvet Sky is getting closer as they get over this 17th. Which they all jump nicely. And plays the Duchess has regained the lead. Going on again by a length. So Penelope Pitstop in second. Lincoln Holt is third. In L. Woods, Langley Street. Still quietly making ground around the outside as they get over the next. All oh, safely over that one once. Dropped away a bit was Stone Cold Steve Austin. But it's placed the Duchess. Still in front. Now Velvet Sky comes sweeping around the outside. To move into second place ahead of Penelope Pit Stop. Lincoln Hulk is still there. Langley Streak still there. So is Elwood. So is Tuxford. And Ella Casaida. Stone Cold Stone Austin is trying to get back into it again now as they get over the fourth last. And over that one, place the Duchess. Battles on again in the lead from Velvet Sky and Tuxford. Just three to jump. Penelope Pit Stop starts to backtrack. Then comes Langley Streak. Stone Cold Steve Austin is now making a forward move. Setters moving on well as well as they get over the third from home. They're all safely over the third from home. And it's still placed the Duchess. Two lengths clear again now of Velvet Sky in second. Tuxford in third. Stone Cold Steve Austin moves into fourth. Settlers on the inside fifth. Penelope Pit Stop looks like she's going backwards. Langley Streak is next. Then El Woods and Ella Casaida as they come down towards the final two fences then now and place the Duchess has gone two and a half lengths clear skips over he gets away from it well mistake there by Tuxford now Penelope pit stop getting back into it moving back into third but it's place the Duchess who's the leader place the Duchess from Velvet Sky here comes Settler here comes Langley Streak over the final fence they go place the Duchess is over in the lead here comes Settler now with a big charge Ideal Arts trying to get into it so is Tuxford but it's still in the lead is place the Duchess Settler is trying to get up there Settler's beginning to get up but place and Duchess is battling back and place and Duchess does not want to be headed and place and Duchess is gonna hang on and just take it what a brave win ideal art was close up as well at the end Lincoln Holt fell at the last I think but place the Duchess what a brave performance to hang on from Settler and place the Duchess takes it for Alex Cherry maybe that's gonna be the turning point for him this season as place the Duchess takes it. Settler second for Craig Beckwith. Tuxford third for Darren Thompson. Ideal art for David Hooley was fourth. Langley Streak for Graham Clutterbuck was fifth. <laughs>